My name is Nick Barley and I'm the director of the Edinburgh International Book Festival. The book festival this year is all about joy. The joy of coming back together after a few years of difficult times and the joy of dialogue, the joy of discussion about big ideas in the world, from the most fun and the most, most uh, exciting ideas in literature through to some of the tricky things we've got to deal with like climate change. Festivals are about peace, they're about understanding between humans. Instead of war, what do we have? We have discussion and dialogue and we have understanding between people. The festival isn't just its events, it's also what happens in between the events. So in the theatres there, there's intense discussion and really interesting ideas being exchanged. But outside, in the, in the gardens of Edinburgh College of Art, in the sunshine, people can sit and relax, read a book, buy a book, talk to their friends and drink in that festival spirit. Edinburgh International Book Festival has really been founded on the idea of supporting Scottish writers on the one hand and introducing international writers on the other. And we are, of all the literary festivals in the world, probably the most international. We have people who speak in many different languages, so we have translators and interpreters here to help make sure that people, it doesn't matter what language people write in or read in, they can come to Edinburgh and be part of the conversation. The next step we are taking is by introducing hybrid events where, in which some writers appear on screen. It means that we can reduce the number of flights that authors are taking. And over time, audiences will get used to seeing some authors on stage and other authors appearing on screen. And so that hybridity, which Edinburgh Book Festival has pioneered, is the key to our move towards net zero. Festivals are important because they're about dialogue and discourse and conversation. They bring people together to think about things which are bigger than themselves. Uh, they help us understand who we are in the context of the rest of the world. So they're absolutely vital for humanity to survive.